I got some new battery boxes. So this is 2, 4, 5, and 10. 10 times 1.2 gives us, hopefully, a voltage that this thing will accept. So, what we have to do now is connect these two. They're going to be in series. Would have rather had one box, but two is what was available. Two fives. And we know that the center of this is the striped side, that's the high side. So we'll put that to the red. And then we'll put this to the other side. Okay, now we're going to put the batteries in. So that <clears throat> should be live at this point. Let's plug this in, turn this on, and there we go. We had power. And we still have it. So this will work. For how long? I'm not sure. But I suspect it'll work for at least an hour or two hours. Probably a lot more, honestly, because I, I looked at the... Um, power cord and I, it wasn't even an amp draw on the 12 volt side so I don't think it uses much power. So what a relief. Now that we know that this works we need to uh, connect this to the box a little better or I mean connect these boxes to the piece of wood a little better or at all <laughs> rather they're not connected at all right now and uh, then we're going to do something about this. I got to get a longer one see what I have in the, in the box of uh, wall warts. I don't think I have any extra leads, so maybe I'll just... Actually, I guess it doesn't really have to be any longer. Maybe it doesn't matter. These are not very easy to get the batteries out of, unfortunately. Okay, so ultimately what we're going to do is we're going to have this connection like that and I'm going to glue this one on there as such. You could screw it in, but I don't have the right size screws. And it's just a cheap China thing anyways. I'm not going to go all the way to the hardware store where they don't sell cheese just to get screws for the, that are the right size when I can just do this. And this is, of course, the infamous low temperature hot glue. Okay. Is it going to hold? I think I may have to put more glue on there. Actually, it's holding pretty good. Let's see if it'll take the abuse of putting batteries in now. Seems like it. Okay, so now. We're going to put the other one here and um, put it kind of like this. I want it to be on the board but not close enough that that could short out there because the ends, the ends are open. Or would it be better to put all the wires on the inside like this? 
Maybe I'll do that instead. Okay, here it is, the hot glue battery box. I like hot glue so much, I used a lot of it under. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we'll put the batteries back in. Okay, and then uh, <coughs> plug this in, and it'll just kind of sit on there like that, and that should work perfectly fine. You have power, so I'll have to do some software configuration on this thing to make it do what I want it to do, but I think the battery box portion is finally taken care of.